What's up everyone, welcome to Rope Flex. My name is Coach Dan Palacios of Kinetic Training. We're out here at my off the grid Kinetic Training facility and this is my Rope Flex RX2100 unit for outdoor use. This is a magnetic resistance system, so the harder you pull, the more output you give, the harder it's gonna feel. And we're gonna do a five exercise workout or warm up that you can execute as a full workout if you complete more rounds and give more intensity with each exercise. So our first exercise is very simple. It's gonna be a high reaching, coiling pull, making sure that we get down into our lats with every single pull, notice I'm sort of waggling side to side and contracting my obliques, contracting my lats and making sure to reach extra high. Again, for the first exercise, we're just reaching high, making sure to stretch out, get those muscles loose, using the contraction on one side to create relax relaxation on the other side. And we're gonna do about 50 pulls here just to get the heart rate up a little bit and start increasing blood flow to those prime movers. The cool thing about this particular exercise is it's a great simple exercise to create spinal movement and get that spinal engine going, create blood flow throughout those lateral sling muscles that tend to get tight and tired as we sit throughout the day. So this is a great way to open all of that up, create space between your rib cage and your hip and start to open up your posture. All right, so next exercise is gonna be a two-armed pull, making sure to retract the shoulder blades and feel those rhomboids working. Now notice we're leaning back slightly and pulling with both arms. Another key component here is making sure that you keep a pretty relaxed grip. If you're not looking to really build up your grip on these exercises, you wanna focus on relaxing your hands as much as possible and only using what you need in order to move the rope. Most of the pull should be coming from your shoulder blades and your lats. So your rhomboids and your lats do the primary moving, moving of the shoulder blades to depress the shoulders and retract the shoulders, taking pressure off of your chest, your biceps, your anterior shoulders, and ideally your traps. All right, so from there we're gonna go into a simple TRX style row, pulling ourselves up. One, two, now here you're gonna need a little bit more grip, three, four, but you'll see the rope flex is more than sturdy enough at its anchor point to hold my full body weight up. Now here I'm already feeling decent amount of work being done by my lats and decent amount of work being done by my rhomboids. So from there, we're gonna take it to the ground. We're actually gonna use this for a modified elevated glute bridge. So getting the lower body involved, you'll see we have the rope flex is suspended slightly off the ground. And again, it acts a lot like a suspension system. So we can do two legs, focusing on pulling with the hamstrings and glutes, driving through the tailbone, squeezing the glutes together, as we drive up with every rep. We can also do this on one leg, which is really killer. Really feel those hamstrings firing up and waking up with every rep. We might do 10 on two legs and five on each leg or 10 on each leg once you're a lot stronger. But regardless, this is still a really tough exercise. All right, and then from there, we're gonna flip it over and add a little abdominal pull in there. Holding front plank or push-up position, depending on what you like to call it, high plank, some of you, right? We're gonna get out a little bit further. We're gonna pike up and drop down. Now on this one, we wanna make sure that we're not dropping too low and collapsing that spine. So we're gonna keep our core engaged. We're slightly pulling the floor back towards our toes with our hands and creating center line strength with every single rep. Right there, very nice. Feel the abs engaging. We can even go into a knee tuck if that one's a little bit too hard. Breathing with every rep, making sure to control our diaphragm 
using diaphragmatic breathing and belly breathing. Okay? That's just a few simple exercises you can execute with the rope flex here. It's not just about the perpetual pulling system. You can do a lot of axillary exercises as well, including biceps, triceps, and all kinds of other pushing exercises too. So make sure to head over to ropeflex.com, check out the Ropeflex RX2100 outdoor unit if you have an outdoor facility like me, or these can be directly attached to a standard squat rack system or even a concrete wall. So head over to ropeflex.com, order that unit using discount code KINETIC. I'll see you next time. Live kinetically.